The largest governments and institutions in the world keep their top secrets hidden away from prying eyes. Today, we're going to take a look behind those closed doors as we explore 15 of the most top secret places on Earth. Number 15, the Coca-Cola Vault. All right, let's kick off this list with something sweet yet surprising. Coca-Cola is not only one of the biggest corporations in history, but it's also one of the most highly coveted formulas in the world. But the secret formula isn't kept in a password-protected encrypted file on a computer somewhere or in someone's journal that never leaves their sight. Instead, the first step to uncovering the formula for the soda pop is inside a vault, a comically large vault. The vault can be found in Atlanta, Georgia, with a massive and thick steel door. If you manage to get clearance to the vault, you'll find metal bars. If you can get past those, you'll see a small metal box. And if you can get the key to the box, there you won't find the formula, but a map to the formula. The entire operation is absolutely insane, with so many moving parts you'd think you'd land to yourself in the next National Treasure movie. The Coca-Cola vault is under 24-hour surveillance, protected by armed guards, and the only way into the vault itself is via the keypad and hand scanner. The recipe for Coca-Cola is one of the best-kept and closely guarded secrets of all time. Number 14. Chapel of the Tablet the Church of Our Lady of Mary of Zion is open to the public for both worshippers and travelers alike. At first glance, it doesn't seem like much, but if you delve a little deeper, you'll find that it holds one of the most coveted artifacts in human history. Allegedly, there's a section of the church known as the Chapel of the Tablet, which is said to house the Ark of the Covenant. The church goes back to the 4th century AD when the illustrious Ark was brought to Ethiopia by the son of the Queen of Sheba and has remained there for the last 2,000 years. And despite the church having been destroyed and rebuilt a number of times, the Ark of the Covenant remains intact. The thing is, no one's ever seen the Ark, and only one person is allowed into the Chapel of the Tablet. But the catch? They're not allowed out. The Chapel of the Tablet is guarded by a single virgin sentinel who lives there. Also known as the Guardian of the Covenant, this sentinel guard was appointed by the previous after they died, and she will have to do the same thing in her last days on this earth. Number 13. Moscow, Metro 2 All right, say what you will about the Soviet Union, but it was an incredibly interesting time in both human and Russian history that gave way to no shortage of oddities, many of which will never be uncovered. But there's one in particular that's extra strange, the Moscow Metro 2. Built during the reign of Joseph Stalin, Moscow Metro 2 is a system of underground transportation in the event of a nuclear holocaust that never happened. This metro system connects important institutions like the Kremlin to the General Staff Academy to the Nukovo Airport and could have been the perfect way for heads of state and military leaders to not only make quick escapes, but move about the cities completely undetected. There are so many general conspiracy theories surrounding secret underground government facilities and passages, and while many of them may be a bit too silly to be true, the Moscow Metro is very real and very off-limits. Not only this, but the Moscow Metro administration denies its very existence. In 1994, some urban explorers managed to find their way inside through less than legal means and confirmed everyone's suspicions. Now, the only way down there is via a special pass, one that's not easily given out. Number 12. Pluto's Gate Pluto's Gate in Turkey has been around since ancient times and gave the townsfolk the heebie-jeebies. No one dared enter because the story said that once you go inside, you never come out. And even today, no one's allowed inside. So what is exactly going on here? People have been employing tests here since the olden days, the first of which involved letting birds into Pluto's gate to see what would happen. They all died almost immediately. Cut to modern times, though, where scientists can run less cruel experiments. And what made Pluto's gate so deadly is the high concentration of CO2, enough to kill a human in a matter of minutes. The gas at Pluto's gate dissipates during the day from the sun, but at night, when it's colder out, the CO2 becomes incredibly heavy in the air and cools up, making this one place you absolutely cannot visit. Number 11. Fort Knox Fort Knox in the United States is home to more than half of the country's gold reserve, so it would make sense that it's in one of the most top-secret places in the world. And sure, you can see it from afar, but if you think you're getting anywhere near those grounds, you're sorely mistaken, because it's one of the most heavily guarded places in the world. Not even staff members have access to the vault itself. 
With the way that the vault of Fort Knox is set up, you'll need multiple combinations to get through to the mountains of gold, but each staff member has the combination to just one of the locks. So if they want to get in, they'll need to put their heads together and input the correct sequence of numbers to have a chance. Yeah, that's pretty secure. Then there's the building itself, which is completely impervious to attack. Fort Knox is made of concrete-lined granite, which is reinforced by steel, so it's not going anywhere. Number 10. Disney Club 33 There are people with year-round passes to Disney World that must have been there dozens upon dozens of times, and while they may think they've seen it all, they're dead wrong. Disney World is home to the top-secret Disney Club 33, an exclusive members-only club and the only part of the park that serves alcohol. The top-secret club was originally designed by none other than the man himself, Walt Disney, as a place to kick back, relax, and put his feet up at the end of a day, and even as a space to entertain some associates on occasion. Walt Disney died before the club had officially opened, but the show, as they say, must go on. The invitation-only club that is Disney Club 33 demands a $100,000 membership fee to start, and then another $30,000 a month to maintain your elite status. As you can imagine, members don't spread any information regarding the club to outsiders, so very little is known about it. Not even Mickey is a member. Number 9. Fukushima Exclusion Zone while it may be an incredibly resilient country, Japan withstood more disasters than anyone should have to, with the Fukushima nuclear disaster being one of the worst. But the event also left behind what's known as the Fukushima Exclusion Zone, which is totally off-limits. The areas of Fukushima have become so irradiated that nothing and no one can survive there without the proper equipment, which is why the government made it illegal for anyone to tread into the now-abandoned city. In 2016, though, one photographer took it upon themselves to sneak into the exclusion zone and show the world what was left, which was mostly abandoned homes, storefronts, and there were even boats that had made their way onto land during the tsunami. The only real signs of life here in the Fukushima exclusion zone are wild animals, either pets left behind or animals who found a piece of land undisturbed by humans, roaming freely and unknowingly subjecting themselves to the horrific levels of radiation that plague the region. Number 8. Bohemian Grove While the idea of the political and economic elite having their own secret underground escapes and rituals may be equal parts outlandish and fun to think about, there is a place on Earth where that's actually the case. Bohemian Grove is one of the world's biggest mysteries, and it's very, very real. The grove is in the woods of Monterio, California, where every year about 2,500 of the upper echelon of American society come to do who knows what. The event has been going on for nearly 200 years now, and only the most prominent and important figures in the world are invited. We're talking Nobel Prize winners, military officials, Ivy League University presidents, even politicians. These are the only people who know what goes on in there, and their lips are sealed. The annual event is strictly male only, with the only women in attendance being the ones working there catering to the debauchery and bad behavior of the elite, as they blow off some steam and allegedly participate in theater unfit for Broadway. Number 7. Room 39 North Korea is an incredibly secretive state, barring tourists and journalists from letting the outside world know just what's going on in there. But there's a place more secretive than you could possibly imagine. Room 39 Room 39 has been around since the 1970s and is supposedly located inside the Workers' Party building in the nation's capital. There isn't too much information surrounding Room 39, but there are many who believe that the organization residing here raises funds through commercial enterprise, which sounds an awful lot like money laundering. But it's estimated that Room 39 brings in at least a billion dollars every year and are more than happy to dip their toes into the lucrative world of illegal drugs, insurance fraud, and counterfeiting to make the ruling party richer. We'll likely never know the full truth about what goes on in Room 39, but one thing's for sure, this is one of the most top secret places in the world. Number 6. Bangar Fort what could be creepier than traversing down the dark corridors of the ruins of an ancient civilization? Well, not much. You'll find the Bangar Fort in Rajasthan, a state of India. Built by a 15th century ruler, the once flourishing kingdom saw its population decrease due to famine, which eventually caused the remaining citizens to leave. By the year 1783, the place was totally desolate, and only Bangar Fort remained. 
Over the years, so many people were insisting that the fort was cursed to the point that the government recognized it as legally haunted. Now a government permit is required to enter Bangar Fort between dawn and sundown. The government will tell you that the visiting hours are the best times to stay safe from the local wildlife, but it's tough to believe after they've already admitted that it's haunted. So who knows what exactly goes on in the dark recesses of the Bangar Fort after dark. Number 5. Jiangsu National Security Museum Back in 2009, China opened their Jiangsu National Security Museum, or to put it in simpler terms, a spy museum. Now, this museum is open to the public, so then why is it on a list of top secret places? That's because foreigners are forbidden to enter. Yep, that's right, and while this museum is a locals only spot, even the nationals aren't allowed to take photographs once inside. It's an incredibly secretive place that shows off an entire history of stealing secrets. The Jiangsu National Security Museum is in Nanjing and details methods and trinkets involved in espionage and secret intelligence dating back to the 1920s when the Communist Party of China was young. The museum exhibits all sorts of weapons disguised as everyday objects, spy cameras, and listening devices that they don't want anyone to know about. Uh, perhaps it was used on them at some point. It is an incredibly interesting museum with an incredibly ironic stipulation. Number 4. Pacific Proving Grounds Between the years 1946 and 1962, the United States was testing all sorts of nuclear weaponry. But how do you go about testing something so destructive? Well, you find one of the few places on Earth untouched by humans and go to town. The Pacific Proving Grounds encompasses a number of sites in the Pacific Ocean and in the Marshall Islands that saw at least 67 nuclear tests in those 16 years. Enormous nuclear bombs went off in the Pacific Proving Grounds, and as you can imagine, the after-effects of the testing were incredibly horrific, with the radioactive fallout reaching as far as Tennessee. So now, anyone who isn't military personnel or an authorized researcher isn't getting anywhere near there. The most well-known area in the Proving Grounds, the Bikini Atoll, has a grand total of zero residents and is still under the United States military control. The soil is so irradiated that eating the coconuts that still manage to grow there naturally will poison you. The area also has a sad history aside from the destruction of the local flora and fauna, as it was once inhabited by locals who were forced to relocate in 1946. Number 3. Menwith Hill Royal Air Force Station when you keep as many secrets as the world militaries do, people are bound to come up with all sorts of conspiracy theories to try to make sense of everything. Case in point with the Menwith Hill Royal Air Force Station in the UK. This is undoubtedly one of the most secretive places in the UK, with a history that reaches back about 70 years. It all started in 1954 when the British War Office went ahead and bought 550 acres of land, only to lease it out to the United States military. Why? Well, no one really knows except for the people inside there, but what goes on in there is extremely top secret stuff. Some people think that it was set up as an intelligence and spy hub during the Cold War, but the Cold War is long over and Menwith Hill is still up and running. The only folks you'll see coming in and out of there are national security agency types. It's all very strange. Menwith Hill has even stirred up a bit of controversy with the locals over the years who have protested and demanded answers as to what the hell is happening so close to their homes and schools. But the odds of them ever getting answers are about slim to none. Number 2. Mercury, Nevada Mercury may be a strange far-off planet, but the happenings in Mercury, Nevada is a mystery much closer to home. In the 1950s, Mercury, Nevada was a thriving community with about 10,000 residents who had full access to schools, jobs, restaurants, bars, and a post office. Everything your run-of-the-mill town needs to keep up and running. But before all of this, the town was very much on the radar of American scientists eager to test their newest weapon, the nuclear bomb. You'd think that this fact would be a huge deterrent to anyone looking to settle down and enjoy the quiet life here, but for some reason, people have managed to stick around as the decades have rolled by. People are still even living there today. And if you want your aunt and uncle to live there, don't expect to be visiting them anytime soon, because access is all but restricted, and the only way you're getting in is with government clearance. Why is this? Well, no one really knows. It's said that only about 500 people live in Mercury, Nevada now, with the majority of them being researchers. But what are they researching? And where did the other hundreds of townsfolk go? Number 1. Vatican Secret Archives 
Remember that saying from grade school, secrets are no fun unless they're shared with everyone? Well, the Vatican must not have heard that little rhyme because there are chock full of secrets, most of them being kept in the Vatican Library secret archives. More top secret than the forbidden section of the Hogwarts Library, the Vatican's archives are said to house over 50 miles of shelving and 35,000 volumes worth of documents that go back over a thousand years. And that's about all the information anyone has. What do these tomes and documents hide? What forbidden histories are they keeping from us? It's equal parts fascinating and creepy. Now, people come in to do some house cleaning and remove certain documents, but this only happens every 75 years, so there are things in there that will never see the light of day or grace our prying eyes. Imagine sitting on a shelf for a full generation. Of course, there are plenty of rumors circulating regarding the contents of this secret holy library, like letters from Mary, Queen of Scots, and even the documents of Martin Luther's official excommunication after posting his 95 theses. And there are undoubtedly things in here that could change not just how we think of our history, but the course of humanity's future as well. It's the type of place that Indiana Jones would die to see. Watch our obscure playlist for more top 15 videos about the more obscure subjects in our world. Sit back, relax, and binge watch all of our best and most obscure videos.